A few dozen miles further to the west and the impact from Hurricane Irene could have been far different for our area. Thousands of people were working behind the scenes to get ready just in case Irene caused any sizable damage. And one of those people is Palm Beach County Sheriff Rick Bradshaw who joins us this morning. Thank you very much for your time and giving us some insight. I would imagine with an organization as big as the Sheriff's Office, planning has to start pretty early when you see a storm like this even forming. What do you do with an organization behind the scenes and how early do you get started? Well, the first thing we do is as soon as we understand the storm's coming this way, we get our staff together, then we start our deployment of assets. You know, this is the largest county east of the Mississippi in the United States land-wise, so we've got to start deploying our assets early to make sure that we're positioned right in the county. So we start doing that. We get our schedules for manpower deployment. We learned a lot of lessons from before. Right, so we're not going to get caught short. So we, we very early plan. Do you move deputies around or do they stay within their substations and districts? Yeah, they actually stay within their substations. What we do is we give them time off to get their own houses prepared because they're going to have to be out here 24-7. We deploy every deputy out here so we're covered around the clock. So everybody has to work all Absolutely. the time. What are the lessons that you've learned in the past storms? We always talk personally about what we've yeah. learned from going through so many hurricanes and that little stretch that we had in the past few years. But yeah. What, what does an organization learn from, from these storms? Well, where the major problems are going to be, where the flooding is going to be, how we get to the people that are in areas that are low-lying. We have vehicle, vehicles that are six-wheel drive vehicles that can actually transport a lot of people, food service, feeding, the, feeding our troops out there, too, because everything's closed. Mm -hmm. So we're self-contained with that traffic direction, problems at gas stations, you know, with disturbances. So we, we deploy ourselves based on problems we've encountered early, and we're going to make sure we're covered. And Sheriff Bradshaw, I hope we just talked to you about planning for hurricane season. Don't want to see any more. Next few months. <laughs> Thank you very much for All your right. time this morning.